People are moving to Denver every single year, trying to figure out where can I live? Where can I find a suburb that is affordable for me or my family? So today I'm gonna to talk about the top five most affordable suburbs near Denver. If you don't know who I am, my name is Deepo Phillips, your Denver real estate agent. If you're a buyer, seller, investor out there that needs any real estate assistance, please leave a comment below this video. And if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, please subscribe to my YouTube channel right now. And all I'm trying to do is be a great resource for you for any of your real estate needs. And I want to be your realtor for life. So the first affordable suburb in the Denver metro area is Aurora. So Aurora is located east suburb of Denver, the third biggest city in Colorado. Home prices are about 5,600,000. dollars went up about 3% the previous year. Condo prices right now, the average is $328,000, went up about 6% the previous year as well. And rents average is about $1,764. And Aurora, it's, its city is growing, and it's growing, growing, because more people are moving into the Aurora area, and the boundary lines are, are expanding. And Aurora, there's lots of new construction homes, and some parts of Aurora, there are older homes. And Aurora is next to Centennial or Central Park, and you will see all the new development going around the area. Also, Aurora is not too far from DIA, Denver International Airport. The second most affordable suburb in the Denver metro area is called North Glen. It's located about seven miles north of Denver. Home prices are about $473,000. It went down 1.5% of the prior year. Condo prices about four hundred eighty-seven thousand went up nineteen percent the prior year, and the average rent to rent something is about eighteen oh four. Small neighborhood with schools, shopping center, parks, and lakes, and this is another affordable city for you to live in the Denver metro area. The third most affordable city to live is Thornton. It's located ten miles north of Colorado State Capital, Denver which is called the Bronco County. Average home price is about 543300 Condo price is about 377400 And the average rental price is about 1896 The cool fact about Thornton is that Thornton was named the honor of the Colorado governor of Dan Thornton, and that's how Thornton got their name. So it's north of Denver, lots of new construction homes, and as I said, it's not really too far from Denver, about 10 miles out. So the fourth most affordable suburb outside of Denver to live is Lakewood. Lakewood is located west of Denver. It's the fifth largest city of Colorado. So the average home prices living in Lakewood is about $628,000. Average condo price is about $373,000. And the average rent price is eighteen sixty eight. The cool thing about Lakewood is that it's rated the number one dinosaur track site in the U.S., which is called Dinosaur Ridge. So you see some tracks and some fossils in Lakewood. And if you love about history and geology, you need to check out Lakewood. So the fifth most affordable city outside of Denver is called Commerce City. So Commerce City is located north of Denver, is mixed with residential and industrial community, and is known for the oil refinery with 90,000 barrels per day. So the average home price in Commerce City is about $542,000. Average condo price is about $390,000. And rent's average price is about $1950. The cool thing about Commerce City is that their major league soccer team is called Colorado Rapids, which is located in Commerce City. So these are the five most affordable cities to live outside of Denver. And if you are moving to Denver or relocating to Denver or have any questions about Denver, please leave a comment below this video. And also, if you still haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, please subscribe to my YouTube channel right now. And I appreciate your time. And guess what, guys? I'll see you soon.